Well, you know, COVID has caused a lot of unusual things to happen this year. We will all agree on that. One of them is spring football as a real season. And boy, it's benefited the Duquesne Dukes. Rich Walsh has the story from the bluff. Like most small school college football programs, Duquesne postponed its season last fall with the hope of playing this spring. And right now, the Dukes aren't just playing, they're winning. After a dominating performance at home this past Sunday against Long Island, Duquesne is off to an impressive 3-0 start in the abbreviated NEC conference schedule. They have a real shot at winning an NEC title this spring, and they say that title will carry the same amount of weight regardless of when it's captured. When that ball's kicked off, they don't, they don't know what time of the year it is. They're going to play football, and they're enjoying it. I mean, anytime you get the opportunity to, to represent your school and uh, go out there and play with your teammates for a championship, I mean, that means something. Whether or not it's a, a COVID year or whether or not it's in the fall or the spring, um, it still carries that same weight, that same importance, and, and that's how we're going to treat it. One of the main reasons why the Dukes are flying high is the addition of quarterback Joe Mishler, who transferred from Ohio University. Now, Mishler was a two-time Pennsylvania Player of the Year at Erie Cathedral Prep, where his dad, Mike, is the head coach. Yeah, being a coach's kid helps a lot. You know, it's just when I was born, I didn't have uh, I didn't have all that the the blue teddy bears or anything in my in my crib. It was a football. Although it's a brief four game season, the Dukes have a chance to finish undefeated with the win on Sunday, which is something Coach Schmidt wasn't sure could ever happen. My director of athletics had talked about this last fall. It's a day by day situation. It's literally an hour by hour situation at times. If you embrace that. You know, you can enjoy it. I'm enjoying coaching football. So the Dukes have already clinched a spot in the NEC title game, and with a win this Sunday at Bryant, that game would be held right here in Pittsburgh at Art Rooney Field on Duquesne's campus. For KDK News, I'm Rich Walsh.